and to think I was worried about you. Everyone, everyone was there for the meeting except for you. Wait. Let me finish. I gave you the watch. I gave you a choice of whether or not you were going to be here. And then when you decided that you wanted to join, I gave you the explanation of what was going on. But even still, I can see that you haven't made up your mind completely. You're staying indecisive, I can tell. Even after I told you exactly what was going on, I showed you the moment that you came here. What was going on, and still you don't get it. Listen, I understand you're having your own dilemmas inside of your head, but this is the fate of the multiverse. Can you not grasp that? You're still trying to choose sides. Don't you know that there's only one right side to be on? And the fact that you're still trying to contemplate over it? Why did you come here just to see what was going on? Not to be involved in what was happening? I went to you as soon as I sent Gwen Stacy back home. But now I see I, I couldn't trust you. I can't. Listen, I, I know you're going through a lot. Just like me. Just like all of us. None of us want to do this. explain to you exactly why we had to. And then, we're all there, we're having the meeting, and you're a no-show. Why? How do I know that Miles Morales trying to Save his father is going to ruin the multiverse. Are you really asking me that? Oh, oh, wait. I, I didn't tell you. <laughs> I didn't tell you when I, when I broke the cannon. All of us, you know it. We've all had moments that we didn't like. That we didn't want to go through, but we still had to because it was destiny. And Miles is trying to break it. And I can understand where he's coming from. Who would want to lose someone they care about? I didn't. Peter didn't. Many of us didn't, but we still did. I tried to break the cannon, and I watched as my daughter faded from my arms. I ruined an entire universe because I was selfish, because I wanted something for me. That's why I know. Hey. Listen to me. There's no way around this. And if you're going to choose a different side, then I'll send you home just the same way I sent back Gwen.
I thought you were going to be different, that you would understand. I don't think I know. I experienced it. I know what can happen when you do something like that. It can ruin everything. Not just for you, but for everyone. I want to protect as many of the people here as possible. And then also I want to protect the universe as they came from. If you can't help, if you just want to be on the sidelines and look at what's going on, then do that. But that's your choice. I showed you how canon offense work, and that you can't break the canon. Sure, maybe I didn't tell you everything about my own personal life, but I told you enough. Maybe you've already made your decision. You're sorry. You're sorry for what? For not being at the meeting? <laughs> for what I've gone through. You could never... You could never understand what I've gone through. And I could never understand exactly what you have gone through. <laughs> but thanks for the apology, I guess. Work this out a different way? In what way are you thinking? <sighs> uh, here we go again. Here we go. Here we go. I've already made up my mind. Unlike you. I can make a decision just like that. I'm not turning back. We're going to find Miles. And we're going to handle the spot. And that's it. And after that... Hopefully... Things will be back... To the way they were supposed to be. Hey, hey. Wait. <sighs> I'm not trying to be harsh on you. I'm not trying to seem like I don't care. I know that you've gone through things. You can understand. You can understand Miles a lot better than I can right now. I know what you've had to go through. It wasn't easy, right? You had tough decisions you had to make even back then. Look at me. This is a tough decision right now. But you have to make one. I heard that in your universe. You were one of the most talented people to exist. You did things that were incredible. And I respect that. I can also respect your heart. I'm... I'm sorry if I... If I came onto you too strong. If I said things that... Hurt you right now. I am... I'm sorry. I've only been trying to keep myself together. And it's hard to... When you feel like you're the only one who's doing that. 
You know that feeling, right? I've closed myself from feeling anything because I know that feelings only get in the way. Am I right or am I wrong? I actually do care about you. During this time that you've been here, you've shown your character and who you are. And I only want the best for you. The best for everyone. I'm not going to make you choose sides. I haven't done this in a long time, but... deserve to go through and I'm holding you right now to let you know you deserved better than that all of us did but no matter what this is what it means to be spider-man I can't let you Make me grow soft, but at the same time, your heart, your determination, your willpower, it actually inspires me. You know, when you said that, I don't really act like the rest of them. I don't. And I just told you why. You can decide to come with us. Or you can stay here, or you could go back to your universe. As long as you know that I... I care about you. I really do. Thank you for giving me this chance to explain. To at least... To at least tell you how I feel. You and I, we... We are very different. But we've both experienced what it's like to feel pain, to lose someone, to know what it's like to be alone. No matter what happens, it doesn't matter what universe you're in. Whenever you need me, I'll be there. You don't have to be alone. Okay, all right, I... I need to go. Leave the others to tell you where we're going. In case you forgot. One more thing. You're amazing. I can't believe I'm saying that, but I am. You're amazing. Maybe I do need to take some things into consideration. But we'll see. I wasn't expecting a hug like that, but, uh... <laughs> I 
I know you're doing your best. Your best is enough. I'll see you soon, okay? Don't get lost in this web of all of these different variants of us. Mm. All right. And with this happiness, I can't stand it. <laughs> Till next time.